So we want to do a surface area calculation for a cylinder. A reminder, surface area, you have to do the area of all the surfaces. So please identify all of the surfaces, all the faces and bases that you have. We have two circles, top and the bottom. So the area of a circle, we've got two circles. So the area of a circle is pi r squared. So we've got four for our radius. So four times four times pi. And again, we're going to be slightly different if you use the pi button on different calculators or if you're going to approximate at 3.14, 50.27. And that would be centimeters squared for one circle. And I'll just do one for now. And then we've got the side, the wrapper that goes around a cylinder. Um, what's hard for people to remember is that wrapper. I think they're pretty good at remembering it's a rectangle. So visualize that as a rectangle. And it's 15 tall. But what they have trouble remembering is that it goes around the circle. So that would be the circumference. So the other dimension is 2 pi r. So then we got one rectangle that goes around the circle. So that's 2 pi r around times how tall it is. So we got 2 times pi times 4 times 15. So 2 times pi times 4, which is the circumference again, times 15. And I get 376.99. centimeters squared also. Because it's 4 centimeters times 15 centimeters, which gets you centimeters squared. Area should be a square on the unit. All right, so surface area is add them all up. Add up all the surfaces. So we've got two circles. So we got the 50.27 twice. And then we have the 376.99. So we've got a 477.53 centimeters squared. So that's surface area. Account for all the surfaces. Some places call it all the bases and faces. Hardest part again is that the rectangle, the wrapper that goes around the cylinder, one of the dimensions is 2 pi r, the circumference.